Here's a little trick with Google Docs spreadsheets that you may or may not know. In this spreadsheet here we've entered some addresses. So we've got a whole bunch of addresses here around the Croydon Ashfield area and you can see they're just entered into these cells in column A. One of the things you can do is to then select those uh, addresses in the cells, go to the insert menu and choose gadget. And from the gadget menu you can add a whole bunch of little well gadgets uh, that do things with that data. The one I'm interested in here because we have uh, information about addresses is maps. So click on maps and choose the map gadget and say add to spreadsheet. And in this little dialog will pop up just confirming that you've chosen that uh, cell range and a couple of other questions but you can basically just apply and close. And what it does is it goes out and finds those addresses and plots them in Google Maps and drops them straight onto the map like so. Let's just zoom in a little bit there and you can see and you can see that those pins have been dropped on the map and the maps of course are completely interactive like all Google Maps are. So that's a neat little trick. Um, if I just flip over to this one, here's uh, uh, a neat little thing uh, you can also do. Um, if you're familiar with the forms feature in Google Docs, let's just go over here and have a look at the form, uh, we created a form that looks like this, asking for someone's first name, their town and the country they're in. And uh, people were then asked to fill in this form. And when they did, that data went into this spreadsheet. And then it was a simple matter of getting your mouse, selecting all those cells. And again, going to the insert menu, going to gadget, choosing the, uh, the maps gadget here and saying add to spreadsheet and what you end up with is this gadget here where it's actually plotting all the points of all the people who filled out the form. So that's a pretty useful way you can use the, uh, the mapping feature that's built into Google Docs uh, to pull data straight out of the spreadsheet and straight into a map.